That is something that we wouldn't tolerate. If there is a fraud, it doesn't matter how long that fraud is dated back. Republic Bank or any bank will have to ensure that the customer receives his or her appropriate refund. A local newspaper has reported that customers are claiming that the bank has only offered to repay for transactions within the last three months. However, in some cases where customers were scammed, their monies were utilized from transactions dated back longer than three months. Republic Bank Guyana admitted in a statement on May 15 that its Visa International debit cards were compromised. This was after days of customers taking to social media to complain about missing monies from their accounts. An investigation has since been launched and the bank assured customers that it will beef up its security. That is one of the measures that Republic Bank would have put in place to help um, reduce the risk with respect to fraud. Mm -hmm. But we will have to continue to work to ensure that we have an efficient system that is one where you can't have the kind of cyber risk that exists now. So we'll be working with the commercial banks to ensure that the Guyanese public are afforded the opportunity to transact business almost risk-free. This is the first time in Guyana that a fraud of such magnitude has occurred in the banking sector. Republic Bank has since advised customers with Visa debit cards to monitor their online activities more regularly to be able to identify any unauthorized transaction. Davina Ramdas for the Evening News.